Hello friends. When we talk about the medicines, the expiry date or the shelf life of the medicine and the storage condition is very important. And mostly when we talk about the liquid preparations like insulin, syrups, nasal drop, eye drops, like this preparation, the expiry date of the product will change once it is opened. So it is very important to instruct your patient about the change in the shelf life of the product after opening. What happened for the expiry date and the storage condition of the medicines once it is opened? Today we are discussing this matter. Welcome to another chapter of One Degree Change, a continuous learning program for the pharmacist. If you look about the insulin preparations, as all of you know that always recommending to keep all the non-using insulin pens and vials in the refrigerator 2 to 8 degrees Celsius. And, but it is recommended to keep the using pen in the room temperature. That means all the insulin preparation is coming with a preservative uh, and this preservative can protect the insulin when it is keeping in the room temperature. So when one insulin pen started to use, the preservative inside the pen can protect the insulin maximum for 28 days. The expiry date of the insulin, all the insulin preparation once it is open is the maximum 28 days or the return expiry date of the bottle whichever come first one uh, another commonly using products related to the insulin or the diabetic is the glucometer strips if you look the glucometer strips there is one expiry date is written but this expiry date also will change for some brand after opening especially for the one touch ultra one touch ultra is a one of the most commonly using insulin uh, glucometer in the world when we are opening this uh, strip this enzyme all of you know that there is one enzyme is present inside the strip and this will contact with the atmosphere and some degradation will happen for the enzyme inside the strip so it is recommending for the one touch ultra once it is opened the strip will valid uh, only for six months but in the case of uh, AcuCheck Performa, if you are keep tightly closed, it can. In the case of Freestyle and the buyer, the strip can use until the expiry date written in the bottle, even if it is, even if it is opened. Next, we can see about the eye drops. The shelf life of the eye drop will reduce to one month in the case of most of the brands. But in the case of very few brands, like Hilo Commode and Allergo Commode eye drop, they are using some special technology for delivering the drop, so it will protect the remaining medicine from the atmospheric contamination. So, uh, except these types of drop, all all the eye drop will recommend to use maximum for 30 days once opening. Hilo Commode and the Allergo Commode use uh, eye drops are recommending to use maximum for six months after the opening in the case of nasal spray most of the medicated nasal spray and the drop also recommending a use recommended to use maximum for 30 days once it is open and in the case of saline drops most commonly using the brands like tonimer or the ocean spray these brands are recommending you use maximum for 45 days once it is open but lot of new products coming in the market like oceano plus recommend to use for one year once it is open when we are discussing about the syrup especially for the antibiotic suspensions All of you know that most of the antibiotics are coming as a powder form and it is recommended to reconstitute this powder by adding the water before uh, giving the medicine to the child. So expiry date of this antibiotics will change when it is reconstituted. Most of the antibiotics are recommended to use maximum 10 days to 14 days once it is open after these 
day time it is not at all recommend to use this type of antibiotic and also in the case of most of the antibiotic like azithromycin or amoxicillin or is recommending to keep in the refrigerator once it is reconstituted but in the case of clarithromycin it is recommended to you keep in the room temperature once after reconstitution but use within 14 days in our pharmacy there are some products if you observe we can see that it is recommended to keep in the refrigerator until dispensing example like foster inhaler if you observe there are some category of products like foster inhaler it is written that this product must keep in the refrigerator 2 to 8 degrees celsius until dispensing that means after dispensing patient can store this product in the room temperature that means there is some ingredients of the product will degrade when it is exposing to the uh, room temperature for certain period of time so most of the product like foster inhaler that is advised to keep in the refrigerator until dispensing these types of products is allowed to use maximum for 30 days once it is dispensed or when it is once it is take from the refrigerator so it is very important to advise the people about the change in the expiry date and the storage condition of the medicines while dispensing the changes in the expiry date and the and the storage condition of the medicine will different in each product always read about the shelf life and the storage condition of the uh, products especially for the liquid preparations and the uh, antibiotic suspensions before dispensing if this information is help you to make a one degree change in your professional life please share with your friends thank you